Hey guys, this is Double N Gaming, and we are on Battlefield Bad Company 2. I just picked the game up and popped it in the system and hit record, so I'm not going to be doing all that well. This is the very first time I've ever played this game. I I tried to play the demo, the beta version, open beta, closed beta, whatever, but it didn't really work out that well. So I actually cut off, obviously I cut off a lot, because everyone does it with these games. Uh, at least every sane person, because you're not going to want to watch this whole game. See a guy, I don't get him. My teammate gets him, apparently. And I go over here, I thought I saw him. Nope, that's my teammate, so... Oops. Uh, yeah, nothing special up here. I'm just about to skip to another part of the video, because nothing really happens. At all, at the beginning of the match. Yeah, and here's where I cut it. And I think this is actually where I get... No, this is where I s decide I'm going to switch my classes and I'm going to try out some new stuff, so... See what the engineer can, engineer stuff can do, and... I see a guy, I start shooting at him, and... Somehow he manages to kill me before I kill him. Don't know how that necessarily worked out, but I think I, think I should have killed him. But you know what? Whatever, you get over it. It's just a game. No reason getting to P.O.'d about it, and right here, I switched to the recon class, so I, I'm gonna try this stuff out, see what it's like. I don't see anyone, so I turn around, because I hear some shooting, and I see people on the map, and sensitivity is way down, and whenever you first start playing, so I'm not going that fast. I, I alter it, um, halfway through, and I'm pretty sure I have that part recorded, and yay, sniped a guy, woohoo, first kill ever on Battlefield Bad Company 2 is a sniper kill. That's something special, I guess. I don't know. Not really. If you heard that, that was my phone going off. I am sorry. <coughs> so yeah, uh, Battlefield Bad Company 2. I like it. I think it's really cool. My friend Alex says, no, it's a really retarded game. It's stupid because I only like Modern Warfare. If it's not Modern Warfare, I'm not happy. So whatever. Obviously, I switched to the assault class. I don't like how as soon as I shoot that grenade at that tank, it, it blows up, and I'm like, oh, wait, did I kill it? Oh, no, I didn't get any points for it, so no, I did not kill it. Oh, boy, I, I also tried out the medical, the medic class, but I didn't show you that because I didn't get any kills with it, or didn't really do anything with it except get hit in the back. And yeah, I killed that guy, woohoo, a kill, another kill, oh, nope. That's pretty much how it is the rest of this game. Get a kill, I die. Get a kill, I die. Get a kill, I die. But hey, when you get the kill, you feel good. Because it's a new game, and you always feel good whenever you get a kill on a new game. For the very first time you play it. So, yeah. Trying to figure out where he is. Pull out my grenade launcher on this gun. While my enemy, or my teammate is shooting at him. And... The grenade launchers in this game are way different from Modern Warfare. They shoot a lot farther, so I can hold it vertical and it'll actually shoot a little bit of distance, because it has a, I think it has a slight upward trajectory to it, or something, but it's definitely a more powerful um, grenade launcher than the one on Modern Warfare. See him? Thank, good thing I didn't shoot right away, because he ran, and I... I get him! Yeah! Woohoo! I have a kill! Oh yeah! My heart's thumping, adrenaline going through my veins! Oh yeah, and then it wears off because no one cares. <laughs> no one cares. <laughs> Sorry. And of course, see, like I said, get a kill, you die. Get a kill, you die. Get a kill, you die. So yeah. Actually, after I played this game, I um, edited this video a little bit, then went and played some more before I did the commentary. Some more Battlefield before I did the commentary. And I went into a game where my team was terrible, terrible, terrible. Like, I'm they're pretty sure there's a lot of new players to this game and stuff. And I'm not saying, like, I'm really great and they're so terrible it's not even funny. No. It's probably the other way around. They might have just had a bad game. But I'm pretty sure I got most of the kills there. And yay, I kill him. Wait, wait, yeah, I died. Yep, 
Yeah, a guy comes a guy comes at me from behind. I die. <sighs> Jeez, gotta love those light machine guns. I do not cut the video off anymore because it was eight down to eight minutes and I figured, you know what, this is it gets a little bit interesting, I guess. I might as well not cut it if I have to, you know. Why would I? I do not know. Uh, so yeah, this isn't obviously this isn't gonna be the best gameplay, probably not the most interesting thing to watch, but yeah, look I'm so smart. It tells me that the guy's behind me yet I'm shooting in front of me. Yeah, here's where I adjust my sensitivity. Just go down to the wrong thing and then adjust it. Oh wait, too high, too low. There we go. And then I adjust it a little bit higher later to try to match my Modern Warfare 2 sensitivity so I don't get all screwed up on that. But other than that, other than the sensitivity difference at this when you first start playing, it's actually not that hard of a game to get used to. I like it a lot. I think it's a really fun game. I'm doing terrible and I'm loving it. Ah, uh, McLovin. I'm sorry. That just kind of popped in my head, but... So pull out my grenade launcher. Pretty sure I get a kill. No, I don't get a kill here. See, I'm used to Modern Warfare 2. If it was Modern Warfare 2, that would I hit him. No, way too far. And then don't get a kill, don't get a kill. And then I go around the rock. Some guy pops out right about... Nope, so he shoots me with a grenade launcher, or rocket launcher, and then comes down and upon him. I don't think it was the same guy. Yeah, because there's the same guy that shot my rocket launcher, and he just came down and I died. I could have, should have killed him. Should have killed him, but I wasn't focused on that part. I was now focused on farther away. So, oh well. That's my, ooh, tank. Yay, let's get in the tank. Woohoo, tank, tank, tank. And the guy's shooting at me. Like, Perfect, I can shoot at him. But hey, gravity, it's landing in front of him. I'm stupid and don't realize it. And thought I killed him and figured out another guy. I'll, ooh, I'll shoot at him too. Go up a little bit, but no, the downward trajectory is a little bit more than I thought it was. And I don't kill him, he runs a while. He runs off and doesn't kill me. So, basically the rest of the game, I just kind of mess around in, my, in this tank, get used, try to get used to the way, way it handles for future games so I can actually be a help to my team. And then my cat whines like a little piece of crap that he is. My cat is terrible. I don't not like my cat. He doesn't even let you pet him. You gotta pet him and he like snaps at you. It's not pleasant. So the video is coming to a close here. This is Battlefield Bad Company 2. Personally, I like it. I think it's a really good game. I recommend it to anyone who likes Modern Warfare 2 because it's a little bit better. If you know what MAG is like, it's like MAG, only better. So we ended up winning the game despite my sucky niche, but I don't do that bad, I don't think. But rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks.